Right, so the next time you're at the range, a couple of things that you can take home if you're wanting to work on your short game, specifically more distance wedges and then sort of your finesse wedges. Lane Savoy and Rob Neal have done some phenomenal research in some of the best wedge players on the planet over time and there's a few variables that they talk about that are very significant one of them being the ability to control your angle of attack when you play golf you might go from a zero attack angle for certain shots and if you get down in some of that thick rough you might be up to 13 to 15 degrees down so you need that variability in angle of attack you also need to make sure that you can regulate the shaft lean, the amount that you lean the shaft. So shallow angle attack and the shaft leaning forward is going to produce more of that lower launch, higher spin, really controlled flighting those wedges. That becomes important. And then the amount of speed you use, and you're trying to control all the speed with your torso and how much you rotate. Your goal is to really try and regulate your angle of attack, how much you can lean the shaft, and then how much you can rotate and turn because you want your body's rotation to help you square the face as opposed to the independent manipulation of the hand. Great wedge players tend to avoid a lot of slide, a lot of a steep angle of attack, and a lot of hand action. The better wedge players, a lot more rotation of the torso, shallow angle of attack and the shaft leaning forwards. Those keys are gonna help you improve your short game and hit better wedge shots.